There was something so beautiful in this week's Parsha that connected beautifully to our emotional health journeys, and I had to share it. So the words in the Torah say that that when the Jewish people were in the wilderness, on the words of God, they camped, they rested, and on the words of God, they traveled. And if we think about those words and we we would imagine ourselves being in that position, we would think that the more difficult thing to do would be to travel because you're packing up many, many people with many, many different things and having to travel through difficult, potentially treacherous conditions. And actually the commentators on those words say that the more difficult thing for the Jewish people during the times of the wilderness when they were in the Midbar was the Vayachanu, the actual camping and resting in a specific place for X amount of time. And why was this? Because the conditions were not amazing and they were having to stay there for a time period that they actually didn't know how long they would have to be there. And they had to really throw up their trust and reliance on God that they were going to be okay wherever they were and that eventually they would be asked to move and things would be okay. And this actually parallels so beautifully to our journey in life because there are so many times where we're going through something, right? Everybody's going through their own journey in life. And what's easier for us to do actually during those times is to keep moving, to say, okay, I'm gonna change jobs, or I'm going to get married, or I'm going to get divorced, or I'm going to have another child. And that's going to change our situation. We're constantly looking to travel the same way the Jewish people in the wilderness were looking to travel because they imagined that that would be the easier thing to do. Because by Yachanu, sitting in the situation that we're in can sometimes make us feel so stuck. And it takes a tremendous amount of trust and reliance on God in those situations where we're actually sitting in that situation that's less than desirable and trusting that this is exactly where God wants us to be and that when he decides that it's not the time and the place for us to be there then he's going to tell us to travel and to move to the next step in life so I just thought this was such a beautiful message because all of us on some level feel like we're stuck and to recognize that we're not stuck we're just we're doing what God wants, which is Vayachanu. In whatever space that we're in right now, we are supposed to be camping here. We're supposed to be resting here. And when it's the time for it to change, God is going to show us how to travel to the next destination. Hope this helps. I'm rooting for you. As always, good luck.